Hello YouTube, welcome to Not Another Hammerhead Part 2. We waited until we got the handle on to paint it. We've got two handles, hammer handles out of one like three foot mall handle. So we put a piece of tape on there, cut it out with an exacto knife or whatever you got, utility knife. This went in at an angle. You can see it better down there. Because the, the wedge I have is just a little too wide. Put it at an angle, that won't hurt. Okay, we had this taped off. And this taped off. That's this tape right here. We'll get rid of that. We're gonna try to do this all on camera. We've got some cardboard taped on here. We'll get rid of that. Bear with me here. We don't want too long of videos. Not that I worry about how long they take to upload. I just don't want anybody falling asleep. <laughs> Okay, someone's dozing off. He's taking too long. It ain't fun. I don't want to do it Okay, this is a little bit bigger towards the head the handle is because I'd cut some off to get rid of the taper I didn't want any taper on this You ever get tape stuck to you? And there we go This is 12 inches from the bottom of the head to here I want it kind of like cross paint. I'm going to be working on some piece of metal or something there. I want to say I want to fold over make a seam and a piece of tin or something. I can kind of use that to seam it with. That was the whole idea of this hammer. So we're never going to use this and that much. See how close it is to get a piece of metal but you're probably going to be out away from the vise. But it is an oddball hammer but it will be a usable tool. We'll snap a couple photos. Uh, when we formed this we used our round rat tail file kind of keep a groove up in here so when this came down it'd be kind of beveled hope you can tell that and we use this to form it we tried the dremel tool that just makes a mess with the little drum sanding thing makes mess I end up doing it most of it by hand yeah it didn't take too long there's probably a few hours in the shape and it's taking a break because it was just a solid piece of wood when I started so I had to make all this the tenon part custom made of this hammer. I have a three pound sledge that has a hole even smaller than this so there you go. It's too long. I'm looking at the timer and we'll give you a couple pictures of it. Thanks for watching.